Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to give you a short overview of a new simulation from FET and how you can add it into your website. Let's go ahead and take a look at this new simulation from FET, a resource that I've mentioned many times over the years on my blog and on my YouTube channel. Let's take a look at what this one is. It's all about sound waves, and it's a prototype one they announced just last week. It's written in HTML5, like almost all of them are now, and so that means it'll work in your web browser. It'll also work on your iPad or other tablet. Let's click that play button and launch right into the simulation. And here's a little intro about it. And you can kind of see this is a little simulation about sound waves and it is adjustable. You can adjust the frequency over here and we'll see the sound waves change. And we can change it down this way. And notice the change again. And we can do the same thing with amplitude. Or we go down this way and notice the speaker moves a little bit less. Now, you can also point out that we can move the person here on the screen. And we can use the listener audio option. Personally, it's really hard to hear. But it is there and it is an option that you can turn on. Now, there's some activities you can do here, like measuring. And we can see here, we can start that. And again, we can adjust it. And we can run little experiments that way. Now I'm gonna stop it. And we can go over here and do the same thing with two sources of sound at the same time. We also have an activity for reflection of sound and we can adjust that wall position and that wall angle and see how the sound waves bounce back and forth there and you can see I can even change out my mode and I can fire a pulse instead of using the continuous mode and firing the pulse is kind of neat because I think that's a little bit easier for some students to pick up on and to see. And then we have the option here for air pressure and we can make measurements and see the effects of air pressure. Now, if I close out of this and I'll go back, I can show you right here we have the option to get the embed code. Let's copy that embed code. I'm gonna copy that to my clipboard. I'm gonna put it in my Google site. Go over here to Google Sites, and I'm going to embed into Google Sites using the embed code option. I'm going to paste that in, hit next. Let's insert that right into the page. Now we're going to need to click and drag to make sure it fits correctly. There it is. And now I have that sound wave simulation added directly into my Google Site. So that's FET's new Soundwave simulation. They have a lot more resources to go along with it on their website. Make sure you check it out. I have it linked up in the description down below. And for more things like this, including more Google Sites tutorials, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.